today's video because it is going to be all about food and all of the summer treats and stuff that I've made for y'all. I'm going to be showing y'all five different treats that I've decided to make and I've found on Pinterest and stuff and they're perfect for the summer, especially for kids and your babysitting and they're really easy and so I'm really excited about today's video and if any of you guys see this video and end up making one of these, I would love to see it. You can just share it with me on Twitter and yeah, I hope you guys enjoy them. Okay, so this first treat is called breakfast cereal popsicles and all you're going to need is one whole banana and I just like cut them up. A tip for this is to like cut them up really small so you don't have to spend as much time mashing them and then you're just going to take a half a cup of strawberries and mix them in with that. And then you're going to want to take half a cup of strawberry milk and then just stir that together. And then you're going to do the same thing but this time it's going to be with one cup of vanilla Greek yogurt. And then for the fun part you're going to take half a cup of fruity pebbles and half a cup of fruit loops and mix that all together. And then you're just going to get a spoon and go ahead and fill up all of your popsicle holders and make sure so that you leave at least an inch of room at the top so that we can top it all off with fruity pebbles. And then once you're done filling all of them up, you're just going to put the popsicle holders in there. And if you don't have that, then use popsicle sticks and you're going to let it freeze for at least 8 hours. And then when you're all done, it should look something like this. And then this next snack is called Banana Pops and this is probably one of the most popular snacks to do in the summer and it's super easy to do. All you're going to need is bananas, chocolate, any kind of toppings you want, and then popsicle sticks. So the first thing you're going to do is just put a popsicle stick in all your bananas, pretty simple. And then you're just going to want to cover it all in chocolate. And once you're done with the chocolate, you're just going to want to immediately put on whatever kind of topping you want. In this video, I'm just going to use sprinkles, oats, coconuts, and peanuts. And then once you let them freeze for about an hour, they should come out looking something like this. This next project is definitely one of the easiest ones to do. All you're going to need is popcorn, white chocolate, pop rocks, and some sprinkles. And then all you're going to do is pop the popcorn and lay it out flat on a pan. And make sure you have wax paper so it doesn't get too messy. And you're going to go ahead and get white chocolate, melt it, and then go ahead and drizzle it all over the popcorn. And make sure you mix it all up as well. And then you're just going to go ahead and sprinkle all of the pop rocks all over the popcorn and then do the same thing with the sprinkles. And there you have it. It's super easy to do and super tasty and the kids really, really enjoy this kind of stuff. Thank you. 
And this next snack is going to be called Banana Split Bites. Pretty simple. All you're going to need are bananas, strawberries, pineapples, chocolate, and then peanuts, of course, if you want to top it off with that. So all you're going to do is cut up pieces of a banana and a mistake I made right here is that you want to make sure that your pieces of banana are at least an inch thick as well as the strawberries so that they fit perfectly on the popsicle stick. And then you're just going to place them in order at the pineapple and then the banana and then the strawberry. And then you're just going to go ahead and get some chocolate chips and then melt that and then top it off all over the bottom of the popsicle sticks. And then you're just going to top it off with sprinkles or nuts and then you're just going to let it freeze for about two hours and they should come out looking something like this. And so last but not least are these cute little frozen yogurt bites. All you're going to do is literally just take a cup full of yogurt and place it in a Ziploc bag. And then you're just going to want to basically pour it out into a pan. And to make it more cute, I kind of just did um, different kind of bowls with different food coloring in it so that these frozen yogurt bites came out a little more colorful. And then to add a little more color, you're just going to put sprinkles all over them. And for this one, it takes a lot longer for them to freeze, so I would definitely recommend freezing them overnight. And then they should come out looking something like this. So that is it for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed this and got some inspiration about snack ideas, especially if you're a babysitter or a big sister and have to make a bunch of snacks, especially in the summer. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and stay tuned for my next one. Bye! YouTube coming up! <laughs> this is so good! Where'd you get this? <laughs> It tastes good. Uh -huh. <laughs>